Okay, guys, in this video, we're just going to go straight into it. CIG has been making some updates pertaining to the, the way we're going to fly, the way combat is going to work through the feature set of master modes. Now, what we have now is um, in master modes, we right now they're slowing down the ships um, and a lot of the community, a portion of the community has um, some issues with the fact that the ships are slowing down and um, they're not able to do some of the things that they used to do when the ships were able to go like a thousand uh, meters per second and, and, and things like that and um, they believe that CIG is making it too easy it's um, it's no longer going to be a skill um, in relation to combat um, so there's been a um, it seems like uh, that the community is kind of split in regards to this issue as to why CIG is um, slowing down the ships so my perspective on it is we need to understand that cig is building building a combat experience as we are testing it and what they do is they have internal builds they already have essentially a blueprint of what they want to do with uh, ship combat and the kind of experience that they want to deliver and um, what's happening is they're releasing them incrementally so when they release new features and, and things like that like with mass mode at least the first iterations of mass mode um and things like slowing down the ships it's for a reason right they they know why they're doing it but they necessarily haven't revealed it to us so we need to understand that cig is building something and progressively releasing it to us so we need to slow down um in terms of complaining too much as to why they're slowing down the ships. So recently I discovered a, a game that I think I was following a while back and um, I believe it's called Infinity Battlescape. And I think Infinity Battlescape, the way the game is, the way the combat is in that game is kind of similar to what I think CIG wants to deliver in terms of um, the combat experience with um, mass modes ultimately. Okay, so um, let me quickly show you guys, okay? So now, I, I've i managed to play a little bit, have um, a few experiences with it. Um, but the combat in this game is, uh, I think, is what CIG is trying to go for. So now, pay attention to this real quick. So now, the first clip I'm going to show you in this video is how, pay attention to how intense the combat scenario is um, in this, okay? Notice how the ships aren't too fast. They they hover the their regular let's let's say what we consider as SEM speed is around 400, right? So you can see um, the average speed is around the top speed is around 453 for these these ships. And this is an interceptor that I'm flying here, and I'm finding other interceptors. Okay, um, so just see how intense the combat is when the ships are a lot closer and not going at these ridiculous speeds. Okay. So now notice how we can see other fights in the background, right? So notice how I can see other ships going at each other, right? When we're going, if you're going at, at such high um, speeds, you won't really see this, right? You won't be able to see this. And I, I think I'm going to show some more examples of this and um, um, as we go further into this video. But um, also a, a portion that I wanted to share is how dangerous it is when a small ship's like a small interceptor that I'm flying goes near the big ships. Okay, so now pay attention to this. So notice that I'm being attacked right now. And the reason being is I'm close to a destroyer. So what you see here is a destroyer of another player. And 
these things are very powerful. So even as a light fighter or interceptor that I'm flying, it's very dangerous if I go close to it by myself. So now see how quickly it takes me out. All right, so it took me out. So now pay attention to how you can see all the projectiles of the ships when things are slowed down like this, right? See how you can see the fights between the different ships, but before you wouldn't really see it. You won't see it like this because you're going at such high speeds. You won't really notice the the um, the combat that's happening all around you, and that delivers a different kind of experience, I believe. So, so let let me get into the next clip just to show you guys how it is when um, I'm flying in between different uh, some of the cap ships. It's a really interesting experience. So check this out. Notice how, notice how I'm unable to do much damage to it. You can even see that my ship is even telling me this. Okay, so low damage output. See, as a single light fighter, I should not be able to take on a destroyer like this. Look at this experience, right? You can see all these big ships slugging it out and I'm this small fighter trying to distract it i guess in this scenario and i'm not powerful enough to take it on myself right so this is what they're trying to go for look at that you can see the explosions happening on the destroyer you can see it being engaged by other destroyers and other capital ships Look at that. Look at that. All right. So now, um, let me share another aspect here. Let me show you um, another aspect that I think is, is interesting. All right. Check this out. Look at that. You can see the, the, the big destroyer with its big guns. Look at that. If you're going at top speed all the time, you're not going to see this. Look at that. You can see the explosion that's happening, right? Look, look at the explosion that's happening in it, right? Previously in Star Citizen, when we're going like at a thousand meters per second, you're not going to be able to see the explosions happening on the big ships. You're not because you're going so fast. You don't, you don't even see anything. But look at this, when everything is slowed down and everything is close knit, look at the kind of experience this is. When I was playing this, I was having so much fun and it was so immersive to be able to see all this happening around me while I'm also engaging whoever I'm engaging. Right, so look at that, right? So look, look, at, look at the experience that this delivers, right? So the difference with this is with this and Star Citizen is you're not, you're not the ship in Star Citizen, right? This I'm, I'm the ship and that, um, destroyer right there is another player, right? But in Star Citizen, you are a character that is flying the ship in a capital ship in Star Citizen. Just imagine what's going on on the inside of that uh ship in terms of engineering putting out fires fixing components um you know the turrets turret team also trying to coordinate and take out the primary targets you know people working the, the shield generators bringing systems back online all of that is happening while this is going on just imagine that kind of experience It's the coolest thing. It's it's just the coolest experience, combat experience, to be quite honest. It's the coolest combat experience. And I'm going to show you guys um, an, another time when I went and grabbed a 
a Corvette and I just tried it. I, I tried to take on a destroyer. And even with a Corvette, the Corvette was not able to take on the destroyer by itself. Okay, so. So even my destroyer, my, my Corvette is unable to do much damage to the destroyer itself because it's so strong and it's so tanky. So to take out big ships like this, you're going to need a coordinated effort between different ships, bombers and, and things like that to take out big ships, right? And in the previous builds in Star Citizen, essentially somebody that's really good in a life fighter would, would be a problem for a big ship like this, you know? So this is what I think CIG is trying to deliver in terms of a combat experience. They want you to be able to be in a small fighter and fly in between the big ships and the big cap ships are fighting each other, slugging it out. And you can see the projectiles, the explosions happening on the ships all around you. Um, just imagine the background. This is on... Um, in orbit of a moon, as you can see, and all of this is happening all around you. That experience that it delivers is awesome. When I was playing this game, um, for those that are interested, it's called um, Infinity Battlescape, I think. Battlescape Infinity or something like that. And it was super immersive once uh, you're doing this. So you guys let me know your thoughts. What do you guys think about this concept in terms of ship combat? Do you think uh, CI, this is what CIG is trying to deliver? This is what I think CIG is trying to deliver. So you guys let me know your thoughts on that. Before I let you go, I'd like to let y'all know that my organization, Phase 1 Industries, is now recruiting new and veteran players. If you're interested, you can find our Discord in the description down below. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one.